Good morning, welcome back to the vlog, and we are back in we're back in the office this morning. If you haven't been watching the videos for the past two weeks, where have you been? I'm just kidding. I got back from Mallorca last night. Well, actually, this morning at like three o'clock, I went to bed. We're back now. We're back in the office, and I arrived home to two different boxes. I'm gonna take this one, and I'm gonna put this big one over to the side for now. By the way, my old Scott foil frame is still for sale. If anyone wants it, just send me an email, and then I can give you all the details. All right, so. So, so, so. In here we have a package from a company, a brand new company. It's a cycling apparel company called Robert James Apparel. They asked if they could send me out some clothes and I really, really like the simple design of these clothes. So I said, yeah, please send me out some clothes. This is the hoodie, it's a medium. I hope it fits. Yeah, that fits, that fits perfect. They've also sent me a couple of black t-shirts which I'm not gonna open just yet because I kinda like this hoodie, it's nice and soft. But guys, when they asked me if they could send me some stuff out, I said, you know, yeah, that's 100%, please do. It looks like it's nice clothing, it's a cycling related clothing brand. Obviously, I wanna support cycling, like the cycling industry. And I said, it's all well and good sending me stuff, but is there any chance that like we can do a giveaway to, to the viewers where on behalf of Robert James Apparel, I give stuff away through this channel. So guys, if you wanna win a sick hoodie, or some t-shirts, drop a comment down below saying you'll be interested. If enough people are interested, then I will set a competition up. Only something easy where like you go over to Instagram and follow me and like my photo or something. Now, I think I have a pretty good idea what's in that box. I've not actually got any time to open that box just yet. I'm in a little bit of a rush. We'll open it later on. I'm gonna wear this hoodie now for the rest of the day. Now we're back in the UK and it's freezing cold outside. We're coming into the season now where we've gotta wear jumpers again. But the reason that I'm in a bit of a rush this morning is because I'm actually leaving again this morning. I know I'm leaving you, Lexi, again. I'm sorry. I know, I'm sorry. I've only just come back. My suitcase and my bike box still haven't been unpacked. They're going straight back into the car now. I'm only heading away for a few days this time and I'm staying within the country. I'm heading south and the OG viewers of the vlog will know what that means. Did I put that big box in? Oh yeah. Anyway, we've got a three hour 18 journey ahead of us. Let's crack on. Sick. I've been driving for under an hour and uh, I'm, run I'm, run I'm running off like four hours. I can't even speak. I'm running off like four hours sleep and I'm um, feeling like, I'm feeling like down here. I'm gonna stop at Costa Coffee. Try and bring myself back up to like here. Two and a half hours remaining, let's just crack on and get it done. Oh, it's dark, but we made it. We made it. So I'm at my girlfriend's house, my girlfriend Georgia. For the new viewers, she lives down in Milton Keynes, which is like a three and a half hour drive for me. She's not actually here because she's at university in Nottingham. But the reason I'm here is because her mum and dad have gone away for the week and uh, they wanted someone to come and look after the new puppy and also George's younger brother. So I just came to look after this little guy, which when they got him a couple of weeks ago, he was called Dexter, as you saw in the video. His name has since changed to Bailey. So YouTube, Bailey, yeah. How does it taste? Is that, is that good? No, I can't see anything. And obviously good old Duke. How you doing, Duke? Microphone. No. Get off get off the microphone. Get off the microphone. Anyway, I think it's time. Do you wanna come up? Do you wanna come up here? Come on. There you go. You sit down. You sit down. I think it's time to unbox this box. I'm very, very excited to show you guys what's inside here. Or what I hope is inside here. I should probably really have a table. I know. There we go. So inside here is a care package from a certain company called Power Tap. Bailey's gonna help me unbox this. We got loads of different stuff. Hey, what are you doing? I'm gonna put this on. Got some sort of banner here. GPS head unit device. That is pretty sick. Socks, like two or three Power Tap t-shirts. Mate, Power Tap hooked us up. This is sick. A heart rate monitor or something? A Bluetooth heart rate monitor. More bottles. Another t-shirt. Some uh, some zero degree cleats. I think this is a musette. Yeah, a musette bag. A personalized letter saying Cameron. Let's open that up. Let's see what they said. Cameron, thank you very much for choosing Power Tap. Blah, 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 blah. Cheers. The dog's just eating everything in the background. But the main star of the show, let's just move everything away a sec here. The main 
the main star of the show is the PowerTap P1 pedal set. But as you all know, it's been well documented in the vlog. Over the past couple of years, I've been having some problems from some technical difficulties with different various brands of power meter. And a good friend of mine actually recommended some PowerTap pedals. So I reached out to PowerTap and asked them if they could hook us up with a pair which they very, very kindly did. Now, before they sent them, I did say that uh, obviously we're coming into winter here in the Northern Hemisphere, and I'm gonna be thoroughly testing them and putting these pedals through the paces over the next few months during winter, as I always talk about in the vlog. It's often cold, it's often wet, it's often dirty riding on the roads here. So these pedals are really gonna be put through the paces, and if they break, I'm gonna tell you guys that they break. It's as simple as that. The dog's just getting in the box there. No, nope. puppies are so funny. Everything just interests them. Absolutely, even my hand. Like, why are you biting my hand? Anyway, now the PowerTap P1 pedals are a Look Keo compatible pedal, which is, is super easy for me. I don't have to change across the speed plate to Shimano cleats. I can just keep my current Look Keo. Hey, give me that. Give me that. Give me, there we go. And what I like about these is just the versatility being able to change them from one bike to another. I've got a summer bike, my race bike, and I've got a winter bike. So, so often I change between the two and um, yeah, to be able to change a power meter by, by literally just changing the pedals is incredibly convenient. Bailey, come back here. Bailey, Bailey, where have you done what? Bailey, what have you done with it? No, I need that. I need that. Obviously it's in the evening now. Tomorrow morning I'm gonna put these on the bikes and uh, take them out for the first ride. But I'm gonna ride these pedals for at least two or 3,000 kilometers, probably through the duration of winter. And then after that, I'm gonna give a full comprehensive review on my thoughts and opinions on these PowerTap P1 pedals. PowerTap P1 pedals, that is a mouthful. Guys, if you're watching this, once again, thank you very much for sending me out these pedals. I really do gratefully appreciate it. Today has been pretty hectic, four hours sleep and then like a three and a half hour drive. And now I'm in the other side of the country. Bailey just ran off with my shoe. I need, I need that. No. But hopefully tomorrow it's gonna to be all back to normal. Like even my bike, it's still outside in the bike box. I need to, I need to build it up and give it a clean. But I'm gonna do that tomorrow because I'm not riding today. But guys, thanks for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please drop a thumbs up. And remember if you wanna win, uh, if you want me to do a giveaway of some Robert James apparel, maybe a t-shirt, maybe a hoodie, maybe both, maybe give away multiple t-shirts to different people. I don't know. If you'll be down for that, leave a comment down below. But as always, I'll see you tomorrow at 5 p.m.